one of the things that helped me most as a research student working on um, both my honours and PhD research projects was to treat writing as a almost as a sport. I think the best way of writing is is in is in bursts and sprints. So for me, as a as a PhD candidate, what worked, I would often base my writing around three to four one hour writing blocks. I think personally, you work at your most uh, at your highest efficiency uh, working for you know up to about four hours. The warming up period would often come in that in that first writing block, which is write freely to um, write to get words down on the page. So often in that first phase, I'm looking for quantity um, without a particular regard for structure, form, um, and ed editing. All, all of my writing were often based on you know, loosely taken notes that I would have prepared. So I would look at a particular section of notes um, that I prepared and my writing would, would draw from that. The second and third blocks of writing would certainly be more strenuous because that's when I'd go back to revise what I'd written in that earlier block. It would be to edit, to pay particular attention to the flow of my argument, the flow of my thoughts, their clarity. Um, I'd look out for things like repetition. So those two blocks of writing would often concentrate more on that type of the strenuous reworking, the re-editing. My final block of writing would often concentrate on planning for, for what I might be writing for that next day. My, my cooling down period would be to do one, you know, one to two hours of research um, after, after that writing. But you know, that makes it sound as though there's a, there's a consistent pattern to it. You know, it varies from day to day. And, but often I would you know, strive for those, those three to four hours of focused uh, writing. You can get more study tips and advice on the Study Smarter website. Brought to you by UWA Student Services.